Uh, a great night for your team and an amazing goal. For you. <laughs> that was a good goal, I have to say. I didn't expect that, but uh, no, it, it was really, really great to play uh, tonight. I think it's a really fun game. I never played it, it's the first time. And uh, really, yeah, really nice. How yeah. is this compared to football? Yeah, you know, I stopped already so long, but this is really intensive game. And uh, of course, my condition is not uh, the best anymore. But as long as the other ones run for me, then, then it's okay. <laughs> but you seem to be aging like fine wine from the execution you had uh, today with the backfield. Yeah, yeah, it was perfect. Uh, no, no, I, I, feel, I really feel good. It was a good goal, assist, so it's always nice. You know, you always become a little bit like a little boy again. You want to score, you want to win, you want to help the team. Uh, and I think that will never change. You missed the competition? No, more like like sitting here, no, not this, but uh, no, yeah, yeah. with the guys, have a drink uh, in, the, in the dressing room, you know, to have fun before the game, after the game. And of course you want to win. That's, uh, you also could see, even we are winning with 7-2, everybody wants to make more. So. Yeah, that will never go away, I think. You were nominated at the Ballon d'Or in 2008, if I'm not mistaken. Yeah, uh, can be. Nominated. Yeah. yeah. Tell me, now it's a controversy about uh, Messi. Yeah. Uh, he deserved to win Ballon d'Or and FIFA Awards. Yeah, I think he always deserved it because I think he's still the best player. Of course, he went to America. Yeah, it's it's, it's a different league. But uh, everybody say, ah, oh, when Haaland, for example, what can you do more than Haaland? And that's also true. So I think it's a really tough decision to make the winner of the Ballon d'Or. But at the end, Messi for me is yeah the goat still uh, together with Ronaldo. But uh, yeah, Haaland, Haaland will win also. Ah. Yeah, I have to say Messi, to play against Messi was unbelievable. I was lucky that I was not a defender, so, uh, but he killed us absolutely, the whole team. He was dribbling and I don't know if you remember when we lost 2-6 in the Benabeu home game and he was absolutely fantastic. So he impressed me the most, but Ronaldo impressed me like physical. That's why 40 years old still uh, playing. Really good. Rafa, do you remember the match against the in 2007? I thought it was Tanta. Netherlands lose this match 1-0. Yeah, After but you know what's funny? Everybody talk about only one lose, long, but never. I always win normally against yeah. Romania, but yeah. they always thought about that game. You scored against Romania too. Yeah, I remember, yeah. Two goals. Two goals, yeah, sure. Yeah. Yeah, I, I only remember the wins. <laughs> uh, can you tell me the top three players that you played with? Because you played with a lot. Of oh, that's really good. But I have to say, of course, Ronaldo, Guti. Guti was impressive. Yeah, I had so many good uh, Snyder, Robert, Van Nistelrooy. Uh, Raul was amazing. Uh, so, and I forget a lot of names, but uh, these were, I think, the most impressive. What's the best memory from Maria Madrid? Now I think my presentation when I because I'm half Spanish, so my whole family was there, my grandparents, and for me that was the biggest day of my life that I could see two old people. My grandparents were so proud of me in Spain uh, where they live, uh, lived. So that was uh, for me, uh, yeah, that day well, I, I never forget. And of course, playing, making goals, but this was most special. Uh, Christian, that we won the, the Dutch league and I had a really good uh, connection with him and I remember when he came to Holland, I think every game he got a red card, <laughs> he was really uh, unlucky, but fantastic player, fantastic guy, like a leader and I think he's doing uh, as a coach also a great job at the moment. Yeah? Yeah. Romania has qualified to the European tournament yeah. this year. I think it's a good group for them. I think they have chances. Uh, at the Euros, it's always possible. But uh, and for you, I think it's eight years ago uh, that you uh, played a big tournament. So uh, I hope for Romania that they have a great summer. Thank you.